A quick peek into the locker room as the players get set for the game ahead. Looking to make a big splash here tonight. Hi everybody, time to get into it. NBA action on 2K Sports. With Hall of Famers Grant Hill and Doris Burke, this is Brian Anderson. Joining us from the sidelines, Allie LaForce. Allie, take it away. Hey, Brian. This Sixers team is all in. Doc Rivers saying, quote, we talked about it. We can do a lot of winning, or we can try to be the winner. And being a winner is hard. That's what we want to become. We want the opportunity to be the winner. Brian, there's a difference. Back to you. Looking to be the last team standing, Allie. Thank you. And the Oklahoma City starting five. Steven Adams out there with Serge Ibaka. Then there's Kevin Durant. Then it's James Harden. And it's Giddy in at the two-guard spot. And for Philadelphia, they've got Joel Embiid. Jeremy Grant out there with Mikhail Bridges. Then there's Tyrese Maxey. And it's Holiday in at the point. Well, whenever you bring up the 76ers, you instantly think of Joel Embiid. Oh, no question. He's the face of this franchise. Embiid is as good as anyone in the league. Off the floor, Joel is willing to take the blame when things don't go right. That's who you want as a leader. Now here's Giddy. Pass to Adams. Back to Giddy. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Durant. And it's good with time running down on the shot clock. First bucket of the evening. Now both teams are really looking to exploit matchups here. What's going to be fascinating to watch is which matchups are they willing to go exploit? Count it. I like watching him beat attack on the inside, using his size and soft touch to capitalize. Harden with it. About a minute played here so far in the first. Adams with a screen on Bridges. Here's Durant. No good there. Nice D from Bridges. Outside Maxi. Pass to Holiday. Embiid a screen on Harden. To the inside. And there's Embiid. That one's good. And the assist by Holiday. And there's the process at work. Embiid rolls off the pick and right into scoring position. Now here's Adams. Here's Harden. Oh, they get a hand on it. Embiid with a steal. Giddy against Holiday. Outside Maxi. There's the triple. And it's Kenny with a rebound. And the defense got away with one there. I mean, that's the shot he typically makes. To the paint. Adams, the pass to Giddy. Durant with it. Back to Giddy. Outside Durant. Clock at six. Pass to Giddy. 4 3. They get it again. Ooh, and Adams, strong finish. Well, simply stated, Steven Adams is a force to be reckoned with rebounding the basketball. Outside Maxi. He's now one for two with that bucket. And they may have talked about shot selection coming into this. And that was the mobile one drive. Low resistance to the finish line. And I love the way he played downhill on that drive. Love the attack mentality in a close game. And the improvement of Tyrese Maxey's three-point shot from his first season to second year, just unprecedented. He improved by over 12% with a huge increase in attempts as well. They get it back. Adams, the pass to Ibaka. Pass to Durant. Fades away. Here's Adams. Oh, persistence Steven pays Adams. off as they finally hit a shot. This is Steven Adams at his absolute best. This guy is a high percentage shooter because he understands how to use his frame. Now here's Maxi. And the call will be against James Harden. That's his first foul of the game. 
And for a player with the speed and quickness of Maxi, leveling up that three-point shot changes everything for him. Oh, so true, B.A. It becomes pick your poison with him. And it put him in a conversation last year for most improved player. Nikola Vucevic is checked in for the Sixers. Ben Simmons comes in for Grant. Now here's Simmons. Pass to Vucevic. Out of bounds at the Oklahoma City's ball. That's a perfect example of why good hands are important in basketball. Just misread that pass completely. And the 76ers making a change here. Fultz is checked in. And also a switch here for Oklahoma City. Holmgren, he's checked in for Ibaka. The Thunder have gone just three for seven here at the start. Durant, and he drops in the layup off the glass. Yeah, Kevin Durant, silky smooth. He's got the skill set of a guard, but the size of the center, and it allows him to dominate the paint. Now here's Maxi. Here's Fultz. It's rebounded by Shangoon. Boy, that's one he wishes he could have back, especially against the soft defense. Durant, pass to Westbrook. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. And despite being the youngest team in the league, the Thunder have been solid defensively the last couple years. A great sign going forward for this franchise. on the free throw and looking at this Oklahoma City roster what makes them so good on D well they have loads of length the Thunder have made a point to draft players with huge wingspans making things difficult for opponents scoring wise good on the second one Perhaps the thing I will remember most when Russell Westbrook decides his career is done is how he brought competitive fire and spirit every single night, guys. Now here's Simmons. Drives to the hoop. It's tipped! Outside Durant. Kicks it out to Westbrook. The Thunder with another miss. The Sixers trailing. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Outside Simmons. Fultz against Westbrook. Deflected! And so the ball out of bounds. Fultz touched it last. Here's Westbrook. We've got 113 left in the first quarter of the game. Pass to Jackson. Shangun with it. Maxi covering. And he buries his first look. Well, so great when your offense produces a shot that close to the rim. The rest of the work becomes easier. Picked by Vucevic. Maxi with it. And it's Shangun picking him up. Vucevic's shot is off. The Thunder have gotten 50% of their shots to fall so far. They're 5 of 10. Outside Durant. Shangun, the screen. Takes a 13 footer. Oh, the Thunder tack on two more. Well, because of the size, Kevin Durant can get a clean look from mid range pretty much any time he wants. And he's going for the oop here. Outside Fultz. Simmons, the pass to Bridges. Here's Vucevic. And it's blocked. Durant against Bridges. To the middle. Here's Westbrook. Perfect pass to set up the lay-in. They're beginning to take control now, and this could be a crucial point in the game. Well, working hard, building out a small lead, but you can't afford any kind of letdown here. Vucevic gets the bucket, and so it's Oklahoma City closing out this quarter with a seven-point lead. Defense is setting the tone, and don't go far. We'll be right back. The Thunder, 15.
Hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. Halfway through the first half in this one. And for the Thunder guys, what jumps out to you stat-wise? Well, it's simple. When you can dominate the boards at both ends, you can control the second chance touches. And that's how they controlled the first quarter. I thought they were the much more physical team. You know, one expression you hear from a lot of coaches nowadays, threatening drives. What's the value of breaking the paint? B.A., dribble penetration is so important, particularly in today's game. With the spacing and the great shooting on the perimeter, if you can get to the paint, one, you may score at the rim, but if the defense collapse, now you have an opportunity to find an open shooter from three. Ben Simmons is out there with Joel Embiid. Then there's Drew Holiday. Then it's Jeremy Grant, and it's Fultz in at the shooting guard. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. And from the sideline, let's catch up with Allie. Thanks, Brian. James Harden, with plenty of confidence, said, not to brag or anything, but I'm really good at this game. I'm unselfish. I play the right way. I don't try to do anything I can't do or that doesn't benefit our team. And that mindset keeps me in a good place. B.A.? Very self-assured, Allie. Thank you. Now Philadelphia with it. They trail by seven. And he lobs it up to the rim. Oh, Grant throws it down. Well, Jeremy Grant is becoming adept at how to finish the alley. Who devastates the defense with a terrific look. On the wing, Hart. He's covered by Holiday. And he gets the bucket. This team looks to him to score the ball. They feel good when he's taking the shots. And Harden, a former league MVP, three-time scoring champ. Grant, the only thing he's missing is a title. Yeah, B.A., I mean, it would only help cement his legacy. For years, he'd carry his team only to run out of gas in the playoffs. But postseason success counts for a lot when it's all said and done. Six on the shot clock. Holtz against Giddy. Tries it from 19. Well, the ability to be disruptive with your length. Josh Giddy digging down defensively. Holiday against Harden. Now here's Durant. Tightly guarded. That's good from Giddy on the assist from Durant. And it's a nine-point Oklahoma City lead. The 76ers have gotten only one of four shots to go in. Pass to Embiid. Back to Holiday. And Harden with the block. Now James Harden, when he's locked in and focused, can be an excellent defensive player. A Weiss on the pipes on that one. Durant with a screen on Holiday. Now Durant. Let's it go from the wing. Oh, the Thunder tack on two more. It's just totally relentless, only increasing the intensity level. One thing I enjoy is watching players who don't pay attention to the score. You lock in on the moment and play the right way. Fultz can't get it to go. I'll tell you, most of the time, this guy's going to finish that. But that was tremendous defense that prohibits him from completing the play. Now Giddy. On the wing, Hart over Holiday. Again, Oklahoma City. Well, the mechanics of James Harden's shooting are just so defined and on point. He gets the ball, and he's ready to shoot right away. Fultz passes to Embiid to halt the run. That one falls. Nice assist by Fultz. Embiid's got six. Getting enough shots in close to play inside out. Harden the pass to Durant. Here in the second quarter, just under three and a half minutes played. A little mid-range shot is up, and that one falls. His fifth basket in seven tries. As of this moment, they look absolutely unstoppable. Boy, it looks like their confidence is at an all-time high, just feeding off each other right now. And here's Grant from the arc. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. Adams has got a rebound number five here tonight. The Oklahoma City Thunder, clearly an organization focused on the future, look no further than the median age of their roster. One of the youngest teams in the league. Got it. Even Six points for him. And when you're the ones trying to fight your way back into the game, you simply cannot allow second chances. Well, how about the effort on the glass? Even with this lead, I love that they're still going after it. 
Now a timeout called by Philadelphia. The 76ers will have a different look here. Vucevic, he's checked in for Embiid. Holmes comes in for Simmons. Bridges, he's checked in for Grant. And it's Maxi in for Fultz. So Oklahoma City going with almost an entire new group here. Shingun checked in for Adams. Holmgren comes in for Ibaka. Jackson, he's checked in for Durant. And it's Westbrook in for Harden. There's a minute 54 left in the first half of this one. Pass to Holiday. Shoots over Westbrook. And it's Holmgren with a rebound. That's a shot he'd like back. He's usually going to make those. Up top, Westbrook. Maxi covering. Westbrook with the miss. Philadelphia shooting 32% for this game. Not what they're hoping for. Holiday against Jackson. The shot by Holiday, no good. Here's Oklahoma City now. They've got a 12-2 run in progress. Boy, very hard not to be impressed with the young Australian, Josh Giddy. This is a, a young guard who can do absolutely everything. Boy, he'll usually knock it down if he's left that wide open. Just comes up empty. Bridges against Jackson. Outside Holiday, pass to Maxi. Takes a three. No luck on that one. So Oklahoma City will take it the other way. Now here's Westbrook. Now Shangoon. Maxi covering. The jump hook. And Shangoon gets it to go. And the Thunder lead by 17. How about that pass from Reggie Jackson? Right on the money, folks. Holmes with it. Pass to Maxi. Picked by Holmes. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That's his first. And even from where we're sitting, you could clearly tell it was a foul. At the line for Philadelphia, Rashad Holmes. Taking two shots. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. The first one falls. Free throws good from Holmes. Here's Oklahoma City now. They're on a 14 to 4 run. Holiday against Westbrook. Can't cash in the 10 footer. Outside Holiday. Shoots over Jackson. Oh, it would have counted had it fallen, but it is offline. And so it's Oklahoma City liking their chances, ending the quarter with a 15-point lead. They've done well to disrupt the opposition, playing inspired defense back after this.
just about ready for the second half here. A big comeback is needed for this game to be competitive, and it probably has to happen quickly. You know, Kevin Durant has really been making it happen here, guys. Yeah, tonight he's done a great job of slashing through the lane and finishing. And part of that has to do with his mindset. He has been looking to push the action at every opportunity, and he has been in attack mode all night. And on the floor for Mark Dagnall starting the second half. Serge Ibaka is out there with Kevin Durant. Then it's Steven Adams. Then it's Josh Giddy, And it's Harden in at the point guard position. Now here's Grant. Outside Maxi. Five on the clock. Embiid a screen on Giddy. Maxi. And he bangs it home with one hand. And just a great screen. And they got a high powered finish out of it. And my question is, where was the help? Someone rotate over and challenge. Harden with it. Guarded now by Holiday. Durant's shot is off. The 76ers shooting a rough 29% from the field here. You know, in the past several seasons, there's been one constant with the 76ers. They're going to be among the best defensive teams in the league. Now here's Maxi. Embiid inside. Adams is there. And that one drops. Embiid's got eight. Yeah, he has a really nice feel from that spot. And the size gives him a clear advantage. Well, sometimes when you've got size, your release point is so high that you're going to get a good look no matter what. Oh, oh, excellent way to pad the lead. Yeah, especially when it's your one throwing it down like that. Time out, time That's out. got to be a little bit deflating to the defense, guys. Getting kicked when you're down. My goodness. And Philadelphia calls time here. Simmons has checked in for Holiday. Here are the Sixers now. It's a 13-point game. Maxi against Giddy. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's on Steven Adams. I don't mind that. I mean, they met him at the rim and temporarily prevented the points. Tyrese Maxi. Two shots. First free throw is good. Both free throws good from Maxi. You can tell when he steps to the line the kind of confidence he has in himself. It's written all over his body language. Up top, Harden. He has six. Here's Durant. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. And last season's scoring champion, Joel Embiid, the first center to lead the league in scoring since Big Shaq way back in the 2000 season. Pass to Embiid. Over Harden. 
and the basket by Embiid. Embiid's got 10 points. Part of what makes Embiid an MVP level talent, the spacing he gives your offense, a center with a very good jump shot. Now here's Durant. He's got 10. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. 12 points for him and Joel Embiid. Last season, the first center to average over 30 a game since Moses Malone did it back in 1982, Grant. Oh, B.A., talk about historic company. But how about this? Also the first ever international player to lead the NBA in scoring, too. I mean, he won't be the last with the way things are. Tyrese Maxey at the line for two. No good on that one. Fultz, he's checked in for Philadelphia. And Oklahoma City with a change here, too. Westbrook's checked in. And he sinks the second. Right around three minutes into this second half. Pass to Adams. Outside Durant. Adams with a screen on Fultz. Takes one from 10 feet. And it's slammed in by Adams. I mean, this guy has become an expert at utilizing the screen and roll. Just does such a good job rolling to the rim and being a factor. Now here's Fultz. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. And the foul on Steven Adams. That's his second. That'll be a second foul of the game. And that puts them just one foul from the bonus. And the 76ers making a change here. Vucevic has checked in. Shangun checked in for Oklahoma City. Holmgren comes in for Ibaka. Third quarter action and just under three and a half minutes have passed. Vucevic, a screen on Westbrook. Here's Fultz. Drilled from 11 feet out. Well, terrific to see Markel Fultz knock it down, looking more and more assertive in the mid-range. Westbrook outside. Outside Harden. Inside. Here's Durant. It's good. Off the assist from Harden. Harden's got three assists in the game. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. And that's typical of this guy. He's always reading the situation, reacting quickly, and capitalizing. Now here's Fultz. Pass to Vucevic. Four on the clock. Counted from distance. Vucevic has got five. Well, once a non-existent part of his game, right? Vucevic now is a threat from three. You have to honor that shot. shang a screen on Fultz. Shoots from 12. No good. A bit long that time. The 76ers have got five of six shots to fall so far in the third. Pass to Vucevic. Outside Maxi. Vucevic, a screen on Harden. Fires from 14. And it's Maxi missing. Thunder with a lead. 102 left in the third quarter. Shangun, the screen. Westbrook with it. Guarded by Vucevic. And Shangun gets it to go. Well, superb awareness from Russell Westbrook. Understands where the gaps in the defense almost impossible to check in the pick and roll. Now here's Vucevic. Five points in the game. Outside Simmons. Stolen! Westbrook outside. Hey, yo, yo, right here, right here. 34 seconds left in the third quarter. Vucevic with some nice D. And for Philadelphia, they're shooting just 38%. Their offense not where they want to be. 20 seconds left in the third quarter. The Sixers again can't hit. And for Oklahoma City, they're shooting well here in the third, hitting 50% of their shots. Durant's shot is off. 
Now here's Foltz. Shoots over Duran. Well, the reach of Kevin Durant is a big part of what allows him to be a defender at the highest level. And so it's the Oklahoma City Thunder closing out the quarter ahead by 11 points. Their key to consistency has been their dominance in the paint. They've been the more physical team. More NBA on 2K Sports right after this. Jackson, Drew Holiday out there with Mikhail Bridges. Then there's Nikola Vucevic. Then it's Joel Embiid. And it's Grant in at the three, the small forward. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. Oh, stolen by Embiid. Holiday against Harden. Holiday passes to Bridges. Back to Holiday. Screen by Embiid. Let's it go from 11. And the basket by Holiday. Holiday's got his first basket. Yeah, on top of the speed and power, Holiday makes good decisions. Right there, not forcing anything. Here's Giddy. Tips. And that's out of bounds. Oklahoma City will keep it. Rashawn Holmes. He's checked in for Vucevic. Rashawn. Bridges against Jackson. Outside Harden. Six to shoot. It's Giddy on the wing. The three is up. Not going to go that time. So Philadelphia will take it the other way. Jackson against Bridges. Here's Holiday. Embiid inside. Adams covering. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. Steven Adams. Look how sturdy Embiid is as a shooter. Even with the foul, he's able to put the shot up. All right, guys, what do you think so far on the offensive approach for the Thunder? They feel like they have an advantage inside. And so far, they have done an excellent job exploiting it. And the other thing for this team today, they have a bunch of second chance points. They're turning misses into makes. First free throw is good. And Embiid drops them both. This is what makes him a challenge to stop. He will beat you from the floor, and he can also beat you from the line. And the Thunder call time here. Oklahoma City. We got Kurt Tracer. Who wants to get up and make the noise? Here comes your Philadelphia 76ers EMP, everybody.
gives us a chance to catch up with Allie LaForce. Thanks, guys. Mark Dagnall had some words for his team over the last break. He likes what he's seeing, but he cautioned his players, we are not far enough ahead to assume anything. Momentum can shift in a heartbeat. We have to be diligent, and we have to be smart. As always, Allie, we thank you. About a minute and a half in, Adams finds Jackson, and it's Jeremy Grant with a foul. Jeremy That's his Grant. first foul of the game. Maxie, he's checked foul. in for Philadelphia. First team foul. Now into the lineup for your 76er. Jackson, pass to Ibaka. Back to Jackson. Shot clock at six. Pass to Adams. That basket is good. Off the assist from Jackson. And the Thunder lead by nine. The 76ers shooting only 38% from the floor. Not great. Embiid is screen on Harden. Here's Holiday. Carries it down low. This is what makes Holiday special. His ability to find ways to finish in tight. Now Adams. Pass to Harden. Adams with a screen on Bridges from deep Giddy. And Joel Embiid pulls it down. Embiid's got four rebounds now. Maxi passes to Holiday. Screen by Embiid. Back to Maxi. Fires the three. The Thunder with the rebound. Adams has got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Here's Harden into the lane. And Harden with the slam. Well, with that frame and that power, James Harden leaves no doubt. Outside Holiday. Here's Maxi. Hey, how's that for an answer? Right back with the dunk. Strong performance from him, but he may need to do even more if they're going to win this game. Pass to Adams. A look at the clock. A little under three and a half minutes gone by in the fourth. Outside Giddy. Adams with a screen on Bridges. Giddy. Shoots. That's good from Adams. On the assist from Giddy. Giddy's got three assists now in this one. Well, you have got to be impressed with Josh Giddy's awareness of where his teammates are at all times. Now here's Bridges. Screen by Embiid. Let's the three fly. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. 17 points was their biggest margin. A minute 58 left in the fourth quarter. Adams a screen. Harden finds Adams. Outside Giddy. Ibaka with a screen on Bridges. Giddy with it. And it's Holmes picking him up. Ibaka, good. And the Thunder lead by 11. And to me, it's never easy trying to guard Serge Ibaka. This guy is such a powerful player who is not afraid to mix it up. Pass to Embiid. 125 left in the fourth quarter. Over Adams. And the 76ers tack on two more. Listen, you give a good shooter that kind of look, and it's going to go in. Now a timeout call by Oklahoma City. They're leading by nine. 121 left in the fourth quarter of this one.
the 76ers making a change here. Grant's checked in. Kevin Durant, he's checked in for Oklahoma City. Passes to Harden. Durant against Bridges. Pass to Giddy. Back to Durant. Adams a screen. Five to shoot. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. That's on Joel Embiid. Well, the length and size of Kevin Durant make him a prime target on the interior. So good at forcing the issue close to the basket. Shooting two. He drops the first one. And that'll push the lead to double digits. If you are a defender guarding Kevin Durant, you have got to have great stamina, both mentally and physically. He is as well-rounded an offensive player as the game has ever seen. And boy, good night when he starts to cook. Both good from the line that time. And 101 left in the fourth quarter. Holiday with the ball. Pass to Embiid. Takes a 13-footer. Durant pulls it in. Now Harden. And there's Durant. That one's good. On the assist by Harden. And the Thunder lead by 13. That was another look at our Mobile One drive of the game just a moment ago. Yeah, and that's a little icing on the cake right there. Putting on a show while they enjoy a big second half lead. Pass to Embiid. Unable to get that one. And Oklahoma City will go the other way with it. 17 points was their biggest margin. Durant with a screen on Holiday. Harden, good. Harden. Showing us that killer Three. instinct right now. No letting the foot off the gas for them. And you want to save your best for last. Tonight, they've done that and then some. Grant with it. Outside Holiday. Pass to Embiid. Over Adams. Embiid gets the bucket. Yeah, a real versatile big man with multiple sweet spots out on the floor. Embiid is definitely on the floor. And so it's the Thunder taking care of business in this one. Exceptional effort on the road. They were ready and they were focused. Focused indeed. I mean, it takes a strong mental approach to block out the distractions. These guys stepped up 100%. All right, let's go courtside to Ali LaForce with our player of the game. Ali, it's all yours. Kevin, that was a gritty road win. How do you evaluate your performance? Um, it's a tough place to play. You know, you hear the crowd, it was... It was loud as soon as we stepped on the floor. So, you know, we just tried to uh, play our brand of basketball and just keep growing. The crowd had nothing on you, though. Congrats on the win. Allie, thank you as always. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Doris Burke, Allie LaForce, and Grant Hill, and our entire crew, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for tuning in. And as we leave, we give you our New Balance player of the game, Kevin Durant.